What's the quarter? Yes, today we are on primary science. Primary science. And our topic is energy. When you first hear the word energy, what do you do? Do like this? Hey, power. What is energy? If I should ask you, what is energy? What will you say? Hmm. Energy is the ability to do work. What do I say? Energy is the ability of an object to do work on another object. Yes. If you're able to do work on another object, that is what we call energy. And this energy comes in different forms. What are the forms of energy that we have? We have kinetic energy. Let me just list them for you. We have kinetic energy. We have potential energy. We have light energy. We have heat energy, as in H E A T, heat, heat energy, sound energy, electrical energy, and chemical energy. Now let's take it one after the other. Let's start with kinetic and potential energy. What is kinetic energy? <laughs> kinetic energy is that energy that is possessed by a moving object. Any object that is moving, that thing that is making that object to move on its own is the energy. And we refer to it as what? Kinetic energy. Well, potential energy is the energy in, that is inside an object but has not been put to use. It's, the energy is there in the object, but it has not been put to use. Like when a man is sitting down, or when you are in the car, but you have not started the car. You are just sitting down in the car. That is a potential energy. Like we have in picture here. Yes, the first man there is trying to climb the, the mountain with the bicycle. You know the bicycle is moving. Energy in. There is energy in that bicycle. And it is moving up. It's trying to climb the hill. As it's climbing the hill, it is making use of what? Kinetic energy. It is making use of what? Kinetic energy. At the point, when the man got to the top of the hill, he was just there, static. He was standing there. The way he was standing there, he still knows that there is energy in that bicycle. But that energy has not been put to use. The energy is just sitting there. The energy that is always just sitting there and it's not been put to use. What do I call it for you? Potential energy. Okay? Now you get the difference between kinetic energy and potential energy. And as the man is moving down the hill, it's making use of what energy again? Who can tell me that? Yes, that is what we call kinetic energy because it is moving. Energy that is moving, that is not stable in a place, it's kinetic energy. But the one that is stable, that is standing in a place, it is called what? Potential energy. The next type of energy that we have is light energy. What do I call it? Light energy. Energy that we get from light. Like we have it in this picture here. You can see the bulb. The bulb is plugged to an electricity. But the bulb is giving us light. Or the one we get from sun. Okay? The energy we get from sun. Or the one we get from bulb. The light from the bulb is what we call light energy. The next type of energy is its energy. Its you know I spelled it for you earlier. H-E-A-T. Eat. Everybody spell it. H-E-A-T. Eat. Beautiful. We get eat energy from different sources. We can get it, get it from our stove. When you own your gas, you own your stove. The energy, the fire that is coming out from there, the energy that is bringing out that fire from your gas cooker is what we call eat energy from your boiling water, from um, lightning, from ether. At times, you feel heat on your body. The heat that is coming out from your body is what we call heat energy. These are different forms of heat energy. The fire, the boiling water, from your gas, from your cooking gas, from your stove, 
from your eater those energy that we get from this, this different things is what we refer to as what heat energy beautiful what is the next form of energy that is sound energy everybody says sound energy sound energy can somebody spell sound energy s o u n d sound and energy e n e r g y energy beautiful energy that is produced when objects shake when an object shakes and it produces sound that is what we call sound energy look at the picture here who can tell me what i have in the picture yes it is a jitter we use it to play sound once you put your hand to, to the strings there the the, the, the the sound will just come out you hear it making sound at times when you shake you shake a, an object it will make sound like a bell a bell a, 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 a doorbell it makes sound your tambourine too can make sound your drum sets when you beat your drum set it makes sound those are different types of sound energy the next type of energy on our list is electrical energy electrical energy let us all spell electrical e l e c t r i c a l electrical yes where do we get electrical energy for energy produced by the flow of electrical charge through a conductor is called an electrical energy like we have this picture i'm showing you do you know what this thing is called this is a power line yes a power line that is what it brings light electrical light from the source to your house to your, the pole that is in front of your house this power line gets the, the, the uh, electrical energy and pass it to your own pole that is in front of your house then it now enters your house that is when you can own your tv and your tv will be working that is when you can own your dvd and your dvd will be working that is when you can plug your iron and your iron will be working because it is making use of what type of energy is it heat energy no is it sound energy that makes your iron to to, to work well no but what electrical energy what do i call it electrical energy yes that is that and the last one on the list is chemical energy everybody say chemical energy beautiful let's spell our chemical how do i spell chemical c h e m i c a l chemical everybody say chemical chemical beautiful i like the way you pronounced it yes chemical energy are stored in substances that contain chemicals like uh petrol we have them stored in a container the crude oil will be processed like we have in the picture here yes this is a picture of chemical energy you can see different containers there. that big container there the thing inside that container is chemical yes you store your chemical energy in a substance in a container so that you can make use of it whenever you want to use it now let's go back to uh the beginning again that is what is energy energy is the ability of an object to do work on another object energy is the ability of an object to do work on another object and we have different forms of energy what are those different forms of energy we have kinetic energy the energy that when you put it into use it should be moving like this vroom, 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 vroom. potential energy that energy that when it is in, the, in, in in an orbit it will just stand there it will not move then we have light energy like one we get from sunlight yes the energy we get from sunlight we call it light energy or the one we get from the bulb we call it light energy then we have heat energy 
Yes, like the one we get from our cooking gas at home. You know your mommy's kitchen. She has gas there or stove or heater. That energy that we get from there is called heat energy. Then we have sound energy. When you shake up that and it makes sound, that's a sound energy. Then we have electrical energy. That, that energy that gives you light in your house. That's when you plug your TV. Your TV will start working. That is electrical energy. And the last one is what? You can remind me. Keiko energy. Yes. That energy that's, that, that, that's stored in a container and you make use of it whenever you want to use it i believe you all you have all gained something from what we have discussed so far yes i love you all thank you the next one on our list is sound energy sound energy sound energy is something we hear and the organ that we use so here, our uh, sound energy is our ears. How many ears do you have? Two. One, two. Touch your ears, everybody. Touch your ears. Yes, I have two ears. We use our ears to do what? To hear sound. We use our ears to do what? To hear sound. Sound that is produced by sound energy we use our ears to hear it yes what are the things that make sound we have different things that make sound like humans we your mother mrs odola is a human you too you her now what are the sound that we make as human first we can clap when i clap my hand you can hear the sound Two, two. Two, two. You can hear the sound, right? And I'm singing at the same time. Two, two. At times when you cough, it's made on. <coughs> Sorry, madam. <coughs> Take care of yourself. When you make you, you cough, it makes sound. And at times when you do not the thing, I'm going beat your buttocks for you. You start crying. Who <coughs> beats you? My mommy. When you are crying too, you are making sound. Now, madam is talking. As I'm talking to you, you can hear me. I am making sound. What's up shouting? When you shout, oh, come on, sit down there. You can hear the sound, can't you? Of course, you can hear it. And at times, when you sneeze, take care. Did you hear the sound or not? Of course, you hear it. Meaning that we human beings, we can make sound. Not only human beings can make sound, though. What else can make sound? <laughs> Do you people know that animals can make sound? Yes! Animals can make sound. Animals produce sound. Let's take a few of them. Cats. You've all seen cats before. Yes. How does a cat sound? Meow! 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 Yes, that is the sound of a cat. The next one is goats. The sound that goats make is what we call bleats. A goat bleats. How does a goat bleat? Meh. You can do better. Yeah, do your own. Let me hear you. Yes, you get it. Meh. Meh. And the next one, the next animal we have here is dog. How does a dog sound? A dog barks. And it goes this way. A cock, a cock crows. Have you heard that sound before? If you've been to the village, I know you'll be hearing it almost every time. Early in the morning, you hear the cock making the sound. And a lion. What, do we, what, what, what sound does a lion make? A lion roars. How does a lion roar? <laughs> and all of the animals will be scared. They will run away. The next one is toad. Toad. A toad croaks. <laughs> sound of a toad. <laughs> a duck quacks. Quack, quack, quack. Quack, 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 quack
a duck. A cow. A cow moons. Moo. Everybody moo like a cow. Moo. Moo. What for a snail? Hmm. No one can eat. Hmm. That is the sound of a snail. It's not only human beings and animals that make sound. What other things make sound? Yes, when you have your bunch of keys, I shake it. It jiggles. It's what? Jiggles. Your bunch of keys. When you shake the bunch of keys, it jiggles. And your bell. Ring your bell. Then, at times, when mommy opens a a bottle of um, Coke or Pepsi. The cock, once she opens the cock like this, you hear the sound. Pop! So a bottle cock does what? Pops. It's it. You hear the sound. Pop! Pop! What about your clock? Tick, say the clock. Tick, tick. What you have to do? Do quick. Meaning that a clock ticks. Meaning that a clock does what? Ticks. So what are the things that make sound here as we have discussed so far? Yes, human beings make sound. Human beings make sound. Give me an example. When you clap your hands, that means you are making sound. When you are shouting, oh, you are making sound. Also, animals make sound. Which animal would you like to make like 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 to do the sound for me? Okay, let's let's do that of a cat. How does a cat sound? Meow, meow. Then let's do that of a cow. A cow moves. Mm. Mm. The last one I told you that objects, some materials, some objects to make sound like your buttercup. It's make what sound? Pop. A buttercup pops, pops, pop. And your clock. What does the sound of a clock? Tick, tick. Say the tick, tick, tick. What you have to do? Do quick. Then a clock sound ticks, 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 ticks. Okay, beautiful. That is the end of our science for this week. And I hope you enjoy the topic. And you understand everything clearly. I have an assignment for you, which you must do. Please make sure you attempt this assignment. Assignment is so simple. Number one on the list is what is energy? Yes, can somebody tell me what an energy is? Yes, energy is the ability of an object to do work on another object. Energy that we get from fire is called what energy? Yes, who can tell me? Hmm, I can see you raising your hand up. Yes, Zoya, tell me. Did you say eat energy? Beautiful. You are very correct. We get that form of energy from sun. The energy we get from sun, what do we call it? Hmm, can somebody say it? Hmm, hmm. It is called light energy. It is called what? Light energy. Now, mention four objects that can make sound. Just list them for me. Buttercup, 